To support the development of microbiome-based bioprocesses and reduce production costs, Pramacon researchers have created a dual-chamber photobioreactor. It allows the co-cultivation of two or more different microbial strains. In Promicon, we are trying to culture two different kinds of bacteria. Cyanobacteria that is autotrophic, that is autotrophic, and Pseudomonas putida that is heterotrophic, and use the garden source provided by cyanobacteria. The dual chamber bioreactor enables the separation of the cyanobacteria, which is cultured in the external chamber, from the Pseudomonas putida, which is included inside the ceramic cylinder. This photobioreactor bio consists in an external glass chamber where th that is expo exposed to light and cyanobacteria use this light as source, source of energy and, and fix CO2 as source of, ca of carbon. Um, or modified cyanobacteria is able to produce sucrose from this uh, energy and carbon and this sucrose diffuse into a ceramic chamber where a he heterotrophic bacteria in orchid Pseudomonas putida and these bacteria use this uh, sucrose to grow and produce pacos. The design of this photobioreactor allows to have two different conditions on each chamber, and of course we have to we, we can monitor the pH and dissolve oxygen separately. When we want to implement the two-liter multi-chamber bioreactor, we use this setup. Here you can see the 800 milliliter ceramic. It's a uh, Simple ceramic as the one you can see on the bioreactor for filtering. We, we put this on the holder and you can see the, the magnetic steerer in the outer chamber while the inner chamber is mixed by a standard uh, impeller. There you can see how, where, how we provide CO2 from, the, from a compressor and everything is controlled, uh, the temperature control is, is done by this. And here we have the, pan, the control display where we can, we can control the aeration, uh, CO2 input, uh, temperature, and all the parameters of the bioreactor. At the end, while we are looking, we are looking for the, the implementation of a sustainable bioprocess to produce polymers uh, from an expensive and renewable source of energy and, and carbon source.